Uh, hi everyone. Today I'm going to share about like uh, upgrading a uh, Heroku app. Uh, so just uh, I have uh, deployed one of my um, Streamlit app into Heroku, uh, but it seems like this version Heroku. Yeah, I'm using a Heroku CLI. So Heroku uh, latest CLI. So what is they are saying? I'm currently using Heroku 18. I want to upgrade into Heroku 12 version, and uh, this app, this complete app, is running on around version 18. So for that, I have that. I have the name. So this app name is Sandra Digital Product App. Thank you. Product app. So this particular draw stack questions, uh, uh, Heroku stack questions set to this one. This has been available upgrading documentation. So I'm going to strike out these things. So I am now going to update this one. Come on. To redeploy this application changes, I need to again set the another command. So I need to trigger it. So we have put on the and Okay, I am Now it is upgraded into the version Heroku 20. So previously it is into Heroku 18 version. And now it is more into version 20. Now, whatever that in the requirements dot txt file it keeps updating this uh, all the keeps updating the all files and in that setup.sh I am extremely config.toml and port I'm enabling. The prop file I'm setting up the URL and this is my app simple straightforward app for this particular issue and uh, we have ignored uh, some of the files and uh, so now we have seen is all this all this has been downloaded and uh, now it is all starts uh, restarting with the collected package. Previously, it is removed from the package from version 18 to 20. Uh, and then now, uh, again, uh, reinstalling all the packages. And finally, uh, this app is going to start a few moments. So, it is an app. This is an app I am using. It's a stable tab and uh, we log in. So we are setting it.
now it is completely done the version 11 has been available <coughs> So this is a place where my apps later to log is available and uh, if, you, if you see this uh, screen like in progress Now the build is completed. Then you can able to you can able to see the comparison of all the changes. If you see this, it's like uh, I'm adding a build package to the Python. And uh, I can able to do as many as uh, configuration for this particular, particular scenario. So SSL certificates also I can able to uh, build and deploy. So thanks for watching.